given g of x, calculate g of negative 1. In other words, we need to evaluate when x is negative 1. When evaluating, it helps to put a blank parentheses wherever there's a variable. And then substitute in the value. This will help us perform the operations in the correct order. In this case, x is negative 1. Substitute in the values and then simplify. Negative 1 to the third power is negative 1. Negative 2 times negative 1 squared is 1. Plus 1, negative negative 1 is plus 1, and then minus 4. We have here negative 1 minus 2 plus 1 minus 4. Addition and subtraction, we'll work those left to right. Negative 1 minus 2 is negative 3. Negative 3 plus 1 is negative 2. And then finally, negative 2 minus 4 is negative 6. So g of negative 1 is equal to negative 6.